Hello children how are you all hope you're all fine and safe i am mrs rani third standard science teacher kindly follow all safety measures children wash your hands frequently eat healthy foods avoid going out unnecessarily and spend good time with your parents help them in their routine work so that you won't feel bored okay don't waste your time watching tv and playing games In today's video we are learning science lesson number 3 lesson name is force last two sessions we learned about this okay let us continue types of force in the types of force we have two different types one is called contact force and another is non contact force contact force is nothing but a force which is applied by touching the object okay when touching the object we have already learned about what is force force means a push or pull isn't it children so that when you are taking the match stick and when you are doing the when you are uh, taking this match stick this surface when you are touching it okay the when you are sliding like then the match stick start the uh, lighting up isn't it so lighting a match stick is a example for contact force in the contact force we have three classifications one is muscular force next is mechanical force and third one is frictional force okay so first we'll see about muscular force okay children muscular force nothing but the force applied by using your parts of your body the muscles okay your muscles when you are moving or with the help of your muscle power you are doing some work isn't it so those force those action when you are doing no those the those things are called as a muscle force okay muscular force uh, when you are using a leg to pedal the force used here is a muscle force okay so cycling is a example for muscle force next is a uh, clay pottery last time also i have taught you about the uh, this clay pottery for example changing the shape the force can change the shape isn't it same way when you are making a clay pot you are using your hands isn't it so this hand movements this muscles you are using this muscle this is also example for muscular force next mechanical force mechanical force is nothing but the force applied by a machine okay with the help of the machine when you are doing a work the mechanical force with the machine you are doing a work that is called as a mechanical force okay the force applied by a machine example using bulldozer to dig ground okay when you are uh, digging a ground see in your road side and all you could have seen a bulldozers okay these uh, vehicles will be doing lot of works isn't it so with this help of this machine we are making this work no the mechanical force is applied in this isn't it okay next is a very simple example in our houses we have the mixer grinder isn't it mixer grinder grinders all those things are the machines which help us to do a activities do just grinding the batter isn't it so this is the mechanical force which is applied in the mixi and we are making the work done understood children next third uh, classification of the contact force is frictional force frictional force very good example for is the carrom board have you played the carrom board children when you are playing the carrom board what we'll do we'll apply some powder before playing isn't it why we are dusting a powder on the surface of the board because it will help the coin to move easily isn't it when you are striking a coin it will go very freely and it will give a pocket okay it will make it a palm pocket isn't it that when it's sliding isn't it when it's touching the friction is nothing but the two surfaces okay the board and as well as the coin the down surface is there no in contact it when it's touching okay they slide over one another okay when it's moving one another one more best example i can tell you for the frictional force when you are uh, trying to in the corridor and all some children will uh, try to go for the uh, no they will be going like a sliding isn't it have you seen like a uh, uh, they will be doing a sliding like uh, sliding is also a very good example for frictional force understood children okay next we'll see about the non contact forces 
first one is gravitational force gravitational force nothing but uh, how we are standing on the ground how we are sitting how we are running how we are uh, riding a car how we are uh, riding a bicycle all because of the the gravitational force which is helping us to stay in one place isn't it it's pulling us towards the earth isn't it so the force applied by the earth by the earth earth means what children where we live isn't it in this earth we are living isn't it children this earth the force applied by the earth to pull object okay the object whichever is there on the top of the earth it's pulling towards itself okay so this is called as a gravitational force see example a very old example they used to say is uh, apple falling from the tree see if the apple or fruit whatever it is when it's falling from the tree it can flew away also isn't it it can go anywhere why it's coming directly to the ground it's coming and running the going and uh, throwing in the ground only isn't it same way if you are uh, throwing a ball or any things in the sky okay in after some time it will have to come down and it will hit the ground only isn't it why it's coming to the ground because of the gravitational force which is making to pull that object towards the earth so that uh, force is called as a gravitational force understood children next is the last one is a magnetic force magnetic force is nothing but the magnet okay have you seen a magnet children yes okay this magnets attract the things especially some uh, metals like iron isn't it have you seen iron that hooks pins your uh, hair clips okay girls hair clips mummy will be wearing safety pins uh, have you seen all those things yes those are made of iron are uh, some metals also isn't it so those things easily can attract by the magnet this force is called as a magnetic force understood okay now i explained all the five different forces the non contact forces contact force three contact forces everything now i have few things here okay few activities few actions we will identify which force is applied in this okay children okay first one is pulling trolley what this boy is doing he is pulling a trolley how it's moving it's moving it the this wheels are there when it's uh, working in the ground it's moving with the touching the surface this is called what force with the trolley moving is called as a frictional force and the boy is pulling it is called as a muscular force so he is applying a muscular force to pull the trolley and trolley is moving only because of the frictional force understood children yes very good next is sliding see this sliding it's a very good example for frictional force isn't it children yes good next playing football see using the leg how they are kicking the ball isn't it so this is the very good example for muscular force isn't it kiting okay this kiting also using your hands you will be controlling the kite isn't it controlling the kite and the thread will be leaving and sometimes you will put tightly you will hold all those things we are using your hands isn't it so this is the example for muscular force and next swinging see swinging it's very good example of the muscular force only see this boy is pushing her isn't it nicely it's moving here and there isn't it next is cycling the cycle when you are pushing the pedal okay when you are pushing it the cycle start moving so this is a very good example for what force yeah very good muscular force next kid scooter this is also muscular force and the scooter moves with the frictional force see here seesaw seesaw they will be putting their legs down and they will kick it then it will start rising isn't it so this push and pull will make this to move this force here is used is what force children muscular force very good see here next is a playing in sand okay playing in sand they are playing with their using hands isn't it so what force is applied here muscular force see pulling wood final picture is pulling wood pulling wood it's a good example for muscular force he is using his leg to push this this suggest pulling this wood from one place to another okay next i'll show you 
Okay, next I am showing this car. How this car is running? Car is running with the what force, children? Mechanical force. Understood, children? So these are the forces what we learned today's class. These are some pictures for example of contact forces. Okay, muscular force, mechanical force, frictional force. Few examples for non-contact forces, gravitational force and magnetic force. Okay, so in this today's session we learned about contact forces and non-contact forces. I hope everyone understood today's class. These are the assignment children. Write neatly in the note and learn for weekly test. Okay, thanks for watching. I will see you in the next video. Bye.